What is up guys, this is NHH2 Raw, Sean here. From now on I'll probably say Sean. And I'll, today I'm bringing you guys a little live player mode on NBA 2K12, I got 2K12. And I'm using a point guard, 6'2", 188, from Kentucky. Look how raw my player looks, Just he looks so clean and fresh. It's ridiculous. So pretty much, it's kind of different than NBA 2K11. There's only one rookie showcase, I believe, and it's a lot. I think it's a lot easier than um, 2K11, in my opinion. It looks more realistic and like still overall. With my player with the tats and, and the Dwight Howard sleeves, those Adidas sleeves. And I don't know why. But some for some reason my HD PVR wouldn't let me like I started recording my creation of my player when I, mean, I was creating my player and it just suddenly just disappeared. I don't know what happened. Well anyway, the game goes. No point card. Nothing much happens. I already made a shot and I already missed him. Let's get the defensive rebound. And getting a rebound is a lot tougher in this game for some reason. I'm not really sure. And there's and string of three with the when you're a rookie in your first game it's nearly impossible unless you're a three point specialist and I am not I'm just an all around point guard. Right. You're just guarding him really tight. Pretty much I don't I don't really know any of these guys except for Brandon Knight and Kyrie Irving and I, I don't think I even see Kyrie Irving in this game but he somehow gets drafted to the number one. I don't know how. I, mean, I think it should be me because I just did absolutely fantastic, but I'm not going to spoil it. And I don't know why, they just won't give me the ball a lot of times, I even though I am the point guard. And I love that little play where you just make another player, well your teammate cut in, and that play works out about 50 or 60% of the time. And we are winning by 3 points, and I just get the rebound once again. And I see the shooting guard kind of cutting in, but it just gets turned the ball, turned over the ball. But then I tip the pass, and then my teammate shoots it, which is, I guess, nice. But then I still have a turnover. And then here I get it with the rebound. Even though I'm 6'2", I can still jump for the rebound. Oh, there's Kyrie Irving. He's a point guard, even though I'm the point guard. Now oh, I'm subbing that shooting guard. And then I get the foul. And I suck at free throws. Like, I think I'm using the Michael Red. Reed, or the Bucks player. I think he's still in the Bucks. Because when I was using it on 2K11, I liked using his free throw. And uh, it's just not working for me in this game. So I think the first quarter is over. And the start of second quarter is on, and I already have two points and five rebounds and one assist and zero percent free throws. Fantastic. Alright, I'm trying to. I'm, I really don't want to get that. The, the, those three um, three second violation in that paint. So I, I really get that. I just forget about it, and then I just score another point. A little friendly roll, as the commentator always likes to say. And there you go. And I just get another rebound. I have six rebounds so far. If the team, if any team picks me, it's probably the one that needs a really good point guard who can get the rebound but can't do anything else except for an amazing assist. That dunk by. Uh, I don't, uh, I'm sorry, I don't know these guys' names. Just don't really pay attention to. But I know like a lot of rookies. That's. Probably in 2K13. It was 2K13. I, I, I don't know like what to expect from 2K13. I mean, NBA 2K12 kind of did it all. I mean, if they were about to ask something new. I saw the trailer. It kind of looks similar, except for new on that scoreboard. And then that, another turnover. In 2K11, usually those passes were going, but this is 2K12, and it's way more realistic. In 2K13, I'm pretty sure it'll be more realistic, but. I don't know if it's gonna be like the same thing or a little bit different. I hope it's a little bit different. Like maybe I heard that there was a game contest, but it was like a Guitar Hero type of thing where you have to like press buttons to get stuck. Which I am excited. I actually liked Guitar Hero. 
but I'm pretty sure it'll be different than Guitar Hero. And then I set a screen for my point guard and just goes past it. And then I don't know how I get a bad call for pass when I when I was the carry when I was like dribbling the ball. Makes no sense at all. And it's really hard to get offensive rebound in my opinion. I don't know how. And that bounce pass, they never does that bounce pass when you're cutting when you're doing that cherry pick to get eleven, which I think that was a nice little addition. And even though there's contact, I still make the layup. That should have been one, but whatever. I see that I see Patterson cutting in with that little fade away. Fade, I saw fade away. Fade or layup. And her have six points, six rebounds, and three assists. And as you can tell, five of my defensive rebounds came from uh, with defense. And then I get a little steal. And then Leonard with the dunk. And it looks, this is sick. It goes in. Like, who'd expect it? He missed a dunk, but somehow still goes in. Actually, enough, probably like play of the game, in my opinion. And I, I don't think he. Na well, I actually got an A, a negative minus, A minus once in rookie showcase in 2K11, but it's really hard to get that above B plus, in my opinion. Because some, I mean, you're just starting out, honestly, and you're gonna lose the ball. You're gonna get the ball turned over, and the shot is just not gonna go in sometimes. And as I always, uh, one, and as I said before, making a three, you know, there's Kyrie Irving, looking fresh, and there's <laughs> got a little off track there. And of course, the coach that takes me out. It's halftime. And my draft stock is rising, apparently. I, I did a nice job on defensive defense, and he's cut down on the turnovers. I can do that. Just gotta be careful with the ball and stuff. Just don't make stupid passes or those charges or whatever. And then I saw something up on guard. Now, I really don't like running plays. I just like telling the players just to cut in. I think that's my favorite thing. And there I am, there I am with a simple layup. I think layups are my um, uh, strength and shots from medium and close range is my weakness. And I mean, probably the three point range too. But So if I get the skill points, I'll probably increase those before I increase anything. Because I think my layup is pretty decent for a rookie point guard. And if that if the small small forward would have cut in, I would have had him. And there's Patterson and Thompson. And he makes a three. It's, it's ridiculous how like other like CPU controlled players are making all these threes, and I can't. Even though I think my three is like rating in like 60, though it's whatever. And then I get a little foul there. Will I draw the foul? And this time I was really focusing on making the free throws. And I get that perfect release. But most of the time I just get like late, like 67, like right there. I got slightly early 67, but it still goes in. It's Brandon Knight dribbling the ball. I think, well, I don't know what team he got drafted to. I'm not really sure. No, Kyrie Irving got drafted to the Cleveland Cavaliers. And then I get a reaching foul. Uh, I guess my, it was my first foul, so it doesn't really just affect me that much. So I just pretty much like cut or skip because most of the time they're just like my teammates getting the ball and they're missing. And then they give me the ball and I make a little shot. That was probably my first mid range shot of the day. No, well, my main shot. And my field goal is, is pretty actually fantastic, 71%. That's pretty amazing for a rookie. And then I get a little steal, of course. And I think I just take it in or pass it, I'm not sure. Yup. And I get blocked. It's like I take one step forward and two steps back. But then I, I get the steal, so there's me. My, my stats are 12 points, 8 rebounds, I'm leaving 5 assists. Damn, 8 rebounds, that's a lot. And we're winning by a good amount. I think like 14 points and it's in the fourth quarter so I'm, as long as I don't like screw up I'm probably gonna win this thing and that's gonna raise my draft stock higher and there I am with a one well, sub net shooting guard now I set a little screen for my 
power forward Patterson. And I, I'm just calling a ball. And Cantor. Yeah, assist. I'll be six assists now. Man, my stats. My stats are really good right now, but somehow I never get drafted to the first pick. Maybe this time I will. Another assist. It's automatic right now. It's a 12. They have seven assists, eight rebounds, 12 points. And then another assist. On the player. The player looks too fresh. It's, it's, it's the tattoos and dreads, honestly. Let's be real. And then eight rebounds, eight assists. You already know. And then it's pr after that, it just got pretty much boring and they just started fouling. We had 11 seconds left. Just foul Kyrie Irving, and you know his shots are gonna go in. No. Yep. And they actually came back. I was surprised. It was, um, now we were winning by 14, now we're winning by 7. And then pretty much, he just. Game's over. And three point shot, I have 0%. So well, Alright, I hope you guys liked my little, my first rookie showcase. And I will see you guys later. Bye.